we're gonna start yeah. at yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. All right. We, well we gotta go with who's gonna win the gold. That's right. That's right. That's, that's the story. Well, Guac fought in a very, very good strategic match against Baker, uh, using that Kenkayotsu position uh, very well, and then attacking with Sanage. It's a good job by Guac, and we'll see if Nagazawa falls for the same tactic. They hand out a couple penalties. Actually, I could say right away it doesn't appear to be the case because they're not in Kenkaiutsu, they're in Ayotsu. So it's going to be a different game plan for Guac. Nagazawa can prevail in this match. And as compared to Nishiyama, we could have an all Japanese final. Nagazawa picked up the second penalty there. Guac just testing him with that little koji and Nagazawa turning away in reaction. Well, Koichi Sionage specialist is the usual combination. Guac again doing a good job looking busy here. There's a distinct a distinct style to the Korean men's judo. You can recognize it. Oh, that's a nice little shot there with the Tinarani yeah, and yeah. crack technic tech staff. Both of Massey up in the corner. I think it's okay when we've got two. Yeah. I think when you've got sort of one in the middle and four at the top, it could prove a little bit difficult, couldn't it? Baker goes over there. It looks like Yuko is it's a small score. Here goes Guac again with that Suanagi effort. Doesn't really threaten Nagazawa with it. Just enough to keep him in the hunt as far as the he's selling it passivity penalties are concerned oh, yep, there we go he's sold it again yep. and, he, and Nagazawa is now behind basically in a position similar to Baker clock management for the Koreans is really good for the Korean men as yeah, you yeah, yeah sorry <laughs> I think refrain from passing any further comment on the Korean women's team <laughs> at the moment and in the um no sense in piling it on, right? Yeah. Because I believe that I may incriminate myself as a Korean woman's coach. Oh. Nagazawa probably fancied his chances of attempting a shimmy was in, but it didn't come off. Quark was able to turn out of that. Little over a minute left to go. Oh, big Osodogari the effort from Nagazawa and Guaf right at the last minute able to step off that. Just a minute left here. Nagazawa deep in penalty zone here and with Guac continuing to attack. Just gonna go to the well all day with that. It's been working. <laughs> Song the Nan is giving Nagazawa another penalty. It's a little bit early, Song. I just prefer his fire just get in the final and be done with it, right? Maybe we should have Sung the refereeing exam. 
him on the map. <laughs> now Grant picks up a penalty for an overly defensive posture. Doesn't matter with 20 seconds left, really. Ty Baker behind by Yuko on penalty. Things look grim over there. He's got to keep his feet in. Nice turn. Really nice turn there from 